Hi everyone and welcome to another development progress video. Um, today we're going to be looking at the now completed unit status screen. Um, so what we're looking at here in the MDT is the unit status screen. Uh, you can see all my defined units there um, with their associated statuses and you can see that I'm not actually a member of any of them because we've got a join button on each one. Uh, so what I can do with these units is you can expand them uh, as you wish so you can display whichever ones you want and the, the display will always accommodate them um, so if I was to join a unit for example let's join Alpha Bravo so I just click join and then I can see the various ranks that I've got defined so let's choose superintendent and now I'm a member of that unit the join button has changed to leave and you can now see the the call details more clearly um, I can also set the status of a unit so say for example Alpha Bravo is no longer disabled um, we can see all of our defined states here uh, let's set active you can see that now Alpha Bravo is set to an active state um, and so I can join as many units obviously as I want um, with whatever rank I want so what we're going to do now is we're going to move from the MDT into the CAD because obviously everything I'm doing here is being reflected in the CAD and I'm going to show you that and how changes made in the CAD are then reflected in the MDT. So if we look over at the CAD now um, we can see all the units that we were just looking at in the MDT um, and say I wanted to assign a call to a unit that doesn't currently have one so let's say Golf Hotel oh does have a call let's see if we can find one that doesn't here we go India Juliet has no calls so let's assign a call to them um, maybe the theft one theft and speeding if we assign that to India Juliet you can see now in the car in the MDT that's now assigned if I just join that we should be able to see the call details a bit clearer there we are um, so that's a very easy way have seen that um, calls have been assigned to the units that you belong to um, and obviously if I edit a call so if I now edit this call and maybe add an additional incident uh, maybe it's a road traffic accident now if I add that and then click save that road traffic accident inc incident has now been added to the call in the MDT um, I can obviously change statuses of units uh, within the within the CAD and that's then reflected within the MDT so let's change India Juliet to be active and now it's showing as active in the MDT um, and the final thing to show you this is going to be a very short video but uh, the final thing to show you is uh, call markers and how they're displayed in the MDT so if we uh, this theft and speeding one that India Juliet is assigned to if we place a call marker for that uh, and then drag it to wherever the, the call might be you can see in the MDT we've now got two buttons appeared um, one is a waypoint button and one is a route button if I click the waypoint one um, what that does if I now look at my map you can see I've now got a marker for that call and if I then go back into the MDT and choose the route button you can probably guess what's going to happen but yep we've now got a route to that call mark so it makes it very easy to um, just uh, set where you're going to um, and so and then I can obviously clear that again so that's the unit status screen um, that's now complete uh, so I can now move on to the next uh, stage of the development uh, which is going to be the addition of uh, citizen markers uh, to the cat to CAD advanced so that will obviously appear in the CAD and in the MDT and the reason I'm doing that next is because I need to complete the search citizen screen um, I showed you this briefly last time this is still in the same state it was then but you can see we've got a markers here um, placeholder um, which is what's required to um, to complete this screen so I'm going to create markers within the CAD and then display them in the, the search screen and then that one will then be done but anyway I thought you'd like to have a quick look at uh, unit states and statuses and uh, how that's all displayed within the MDT 
and uh, thanks very much for watching. I'll catch you in the next video.